Namaskar, everybody. Good morning and happy Earth Day. Hello to everybody who's, who's uh, tuning in and um, participating in our global celebration. My name is Jayendra and I'm representing Yoga Sugbu and of course doing masanas and uh, I'm a coach and I love music, I play music and I'm a performance artist. So uh, hello, um, I'm going to say something about our our global celebration and how we come together right now and right now wherever you are at home staying at home do keep that way for now and, you know let's just cooperate and unite all together we're actually available online anyways to communicate so nowadays it's not really that big of an issue about communicating so um, I'm just gonna share to you what are our our family's ways. I'm here with the family. We're at home. We've been here for at least a month, and uh, I think we'll be we'll be staying that way until you know everything is is doing fine, and we'd love to go back and and, and live the life. But one thing, the thing about what's happening right now is what is our impact, and we we actually have have all these um, realizations happen, you know that a lot of you, a lot of us, are actually feeling this, this mood of uncertainty. And I just happen to have some, some good guidance from my, from my teacher about the word uncertainty. And according to him, and I appreciate what he, he mentioned, that he, he's now appreciating that and, and he's, he's seeing that every day as, as one of the most beautiful things. Because all of us, we need to know that everything is really uncertain. The only thing that we can do is that we serve. And a part of our mission here as a yogi pra yoga practitioner is to really be impacting everyone else through service and of course devotion. Devotion to everything else as everything is part of the divine manifestation. So I'd like to share to you all what are the things that me and my, my small family are, are always doing and this is already our lifestyle not just because I'm I'm practicing yoga and I'm a teacher and it's because it's also our our part to basically contribute to the bigger picture that we all know that we are part of everyone else including you you and me and all the beings every being on earth and that's what I'm gonna share to you so we start with the rhythm we use sound in yoga we do what we call kirtan kirtan is this beautiful rhythm of songs and hymns and tune that makes our mind just dispel all the negativity away and prepares us more into clarity clarity of our perception and brings us all into this rhythm within the world vibration of the earth and brings us closer to that even more even deeper brings us more towards consciousness divinity life and love so as you can see we are preparing ourselves into a circle meditation and even as young as they are I'm already exposing them and part of the, the practice we do every single day we meditate at least twice a day and thus children they just follow so what we're doing here we're meditating and also not just meditation we also do our physical postures and that is basically a fun play for some for the kids sometimes and that's also a very beautiful habit that they form, that they take care of the physical body, and they just have fun with it, you know, this, it's a very beautiful memory that they can keep as early as they can start. So in yoga, we call the postures as yoga asanas, and our traditions are coming from Tantra, Raja Yoga. So this is also part of a habit that we do every day, every single day. If I'm not holding classes, and especially right now in the quarantine period, we are at home most of the time. So we consider this as part play and part habit we form every day. So we're just. 
just having fun right here. Okay, so right now I am undergoing fasting. And as of this recording, I am not taking anything except just water. Okay, um, I'm just gonna show you the aftermath of our usual breakfast at home. So I'm with the kids, um, they're, they're I bought this in the market because uh, we're only allowed about uh, Saturday and Tuesday to go out in the market. So I just went out yesterday, Saturday. And uh, here, this is, and then of course, uh, kamote and then saging. This is orange kamote saging. Of course, it's a really, really good buy because this is so delicious. Yeah? And I am fine, let's see. Um, I'm showing you right now the our, our kitchen, and that's a thing. Anyway, um, how we can utilize all these? I, I'm not too conservative about it that we're using plastic, but this is a reusable container. It's better to have one than just buying uh, every time plastics everywhere. And um, just to show you what are um, the things that I have at home, you know, containers. This is a copper container. Very good antimicrobial container. Very good for your health at the same time. Um, what else? So we're, we're all vegan. We practice veganism at home. Um, except for my wife. I, I, I don't really because it's part of a bit of a, a value that she's holding on to herself. So I'm, I'm not uh, I'm not going to restrict her at all. But me and the kids are all vegan. So um, here we, we have our food. We have... Uh, if you, can, if you can look at our fridge. So, say we have plastics, okay? And then when we buy, usually when you go to the market, you would usually have the tendera, okay? The, the, the people selling their goods, they always put it in plastic. It's always a habit that they do, that they put it in plastic. So, um, we remind them and we usually bring something like this paper bag and uh, I appreciate that because you can reuse that and what I do and what we do is that we always make sure that if it's still good we keep it right here okay we have your all the paper bags um, this is where we put our rice and it's not anymore because I just uh, bought uh, a sack of rice and uh, I bought um, brown or this is red rice and I have four kids and really uh, monsters with rice um, yeah and if we really have plastics what we do is that we put plastics in one space like we all have it right here okay and we try our best to reuse them or as much as possible we say no to the people selling and then having plastics so we bring ourselves like what we have like this one or I bring a bag I bring a bag and also we have, we, we cannot, and, and, and I, I don't want to lie, I don't want to deny, we will buy some stuff that is uh, inside of a plastic. So, anyway, so this is my space, this is my home, I mean our home right now. Um, just sharing to you what are the things that we, we do here so we can contribute to, to the world. Oh no! So here, here are the boys. Say hi. Hello. Hello. Okay, <laughs> so uh, this is my youngest boy, and then my hello. eldest boy, hello. and then my eldest hello. daughter is at the uh, washroom, hello. 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 and uh, hello. this is Harry. Hello. Say hi, Harry. Hi. <laughs> okay, so we're staying tucked in at home, and we're just enjoying time together with the family. They're playing. These the boys are playing right here. Yeah. Okay. Play is an important part. For kids, so we we make sure that there's always play. Okay, also another thing is uh, you learn how to to plant your own food to be sustainable. Um, right here at the back of where I'm living, my me and my neighbors are doing their own part to to sustain and. Uh, some vegetables. I mean, my neighbor uh, planted some other additional stuff. Uh, like uh, we call this tanglad or lemongrass. We have here okra. 
I mean, this power power plant right here, Malungay. Come here, come here, come here. And uh, so we're just staying inside our our house, and if we go out, we just stay within the limits of uh, where we live. Just leave it. Yeah, again, just farming. This is okra. That is alugbati. And uh, we got lemongrass here. This is a mango tree. Lemongrass. And of course, malungay. Okay. This is the nangka tree. In, it's at the back. And this is at the front of where we're, our neighbors are staying also. And here, 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 leave it. Yeah. So what's important is that you grow your own food. You can hold it or not. Go hold it. Tambis. And papaya, of course, here at the back of our house. It's just at the back. And some more papayas. Sustain. Be one with uh, your surroundings and of course clean your surroundings, protect your surroundings. Remember that you're part of it. You're part of your surroundings. Sit down, sit down. Very good. Good boy. Good boy. Good boy. Good boy. Stay at home and eat your veggies and love Mother Gaia. What's this okay? Stay at home, eat your veggies and love Mother Gaia. Okay, so, <laughs> so um, everybody, we are here at home again as a message to everyone who's um, watching this video right now for our celebration of Earth Day. A message from the family is to stay at home, eat, eat your veggies, veggies and, and love, love Mother, Mother Gaia. Gaia. All right, thank you so much. Bye bye. Say bye bye, Harry. Come here, come bye. here, Harry. Harry, bye bye. bye, -bye. bye, -bye. Malik, Malik, up in Malik. Come here, Malik. Stand up, stand bye. up, Malik. Stand up, stand up, stand up. Stand up. Say bye bye. Bye bye. 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 bye, -bye. bye, -bye. bye, -bye. <laughs>